Hey guys, Common Villager here, and welcome back to Let's Play Imperion Galactic Survival. Um, I have been uh, doing some work on the base a little bit, just been hauling it out, been digging. Uh, kind of show you what I've done over here real quick. I just laid down a few blocks that I had in my inventory. I plan on expanding this out more because, you know, this is where we're going to be putting in different stuff, uh, constructors and whatnot. Um, also, uh, over here, going to be kind of working on a vehicle bay right here. So I'm trying to bring this back a little more. I'll probably bring this out a little bit more. And, you know, we'll see how that all goes. Probably put like a hangar door here. And then the vehicle bay will be over here. This will all be, you know, the, you won't even see all this rock and everything it'll eventually be all blocks and everything so in today's episode I want to do some exploring and by the way I just wanted to show you something real quick I've been keeping my eye on these uh, Xerox uh, drones I don't know if they're there yeah they're still around but I don't really think they're after me so much now if I, you know of course if I get too close to one they will attack you know that they're hostile like that um, but for the most part, they haven't tried to attack me. Uh, I have actually walked out here and uh, collected uh, some trees because I've been making some biofuel um, in this constructor right here. Got about 26, which is good. Um, today, we're actually going to be going to our uh, blueprints. We're going to go get our... Uh, restored uh, UCH dart um, all that this is a glitch right here let me let's see how do we do this let's see no it's uh forgotten how to large O2 tank yeah there we go sometimes that that messes up and the, it stays there I don't know why but uh, it does happen from time to time but that's it's not it's an easy fix for the most part so um, we're going to bring this into factory. We already got the resources for it right here. We need 131 uh, carbon substrate, 116 copper, 91 silicon, and, and uh, 48 uh, iron ingots. So let's go ahead and put all these in here. Like so. And we'll start production. We'll go ahead and uh, spawn it gonna bring it in here just because I need to do some need to transfer some stuff that's in it should be able to right here yeah somewhere right right in here there we go there we are it'll it'll come down it just starts out in the air like that but um <clears throat> we need to uh let's see I think this thing actually has a Wi-Fi in it let's uh if I'm not mistaken yeah, it does have a Wi-Fi, um, and it should have a fridge. Yeah, this is a uh, this doesn't have much, and you can't really uh, protect yourself with it. But later on, I'm going to uh, add some uh, medium thrusters to the back, and maybe put on like a couple of Gatling guns later on. But for now, we're going to grab some uh, biofuel first. Go over here and grab our biofuel. We'll come over here and access our ship and we'll uh oh wait, gotta wait, let's see. Okay, I don't know I know I know what's going on. Let me uh just come over here real quick and uh disconnect from this uh thing right here. And now we shouldn't have a problem doing that. Let's go ahead and come back over here and get our biofuel. That will fill it up all the way, which is great. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, now we can uh, let's go ahead and uh, turn this thing on. All right. Don't need oxygen right now because we're on a temperate planet. Um, so let's uh, let's uh, transfer some stuff here. 
open our fridge up here. We'll go ahead and uh, access our uh, dart and the fridge. And we will move everything over here. Go ahead and put that back on player. And now we can turn this thing off for now. And that will save some fuel. So we are ready to uh, get going and just uh, explore the area just see what's out there um, I'm not I, I may just explore in this episode just to see uh, where we get to and everything let's see let me kind of adjust the view here kind of a uh, let's see page down and uh, let's see something like that maybe like something like that there we go and uh, let's uh, do some flying. Let's uh, see. Let get I want to get away from these drones first before I check my map. Then we'll check our map and uh, see what's going on. So yeah, there's that ancient shelter we found. I guess we'll go to the west, see what's out here, and just do some exploring. This thing doesn't have a detector on it, unfortunately, but we'll just follow the signals on our uh, mini map thing in the upper right hand corner of our screen when we see a red uh, border on it we'll follow that border and see where it takes us kind of foggy out here we're kind of getting out here in a kind of a sandy part sort of so let's see here yeah, I've been wanting to play the game. I haven't really done much off-camera work. I started working on the base a little bit when I first got on and just kind of done some digging. That's really all I've done. But for the most part, I haven't really done that much. Yeah, I definitely should have. I should have put a detector on this thing. I don't I don't know if uh, your detectors um, miscellaneous. No, I think those might... So, yeah... Well, we wouldn't have been able to make one for it anyway because we don't have a way to make one. But I totally forgot when I was putting this thing together to put a detector on. I think I know why now because you have to have uh, at least a, probably a small or large constructor. Probably just a small constructor. So it looks like we're getting into the Talon territory. Let's see. A different Talon territory, but not going to... Well, I guess I could... Yeah, we'll just go explore. We'll just do a little bit of exploring today. Just see what's out there. Um, don't know what we'll find. Sure is foggy out, though. Wasn't expecting it to be so foggy. Yeah, I don't even know where anything would be at. I just wanted to head in the west, uh, toward the west, so we'll just go there for now. Well, it looks like the sun's coming up over here. So, let's see. I'm almost tempted to go to the south a little bit, too. Just to see what's down there. Sometimes you find clusters of uh, POIs toward the south or toward the north. So we'll kind of head in that direction a little bit and see what we can find. I'm hoping we can find an interesting POI or something that might contain some uh, nice resources that would be nice for early on. But it's hard to say what you'll find. Let's see here. Just stop here for a second. Okay. We'll go around this mountain and uh, See if we run into anything. So far, I have, I'm not picking up any signals on my uh, on my map, but we may run into something eventually. <laughs> All this fog, I I don't like it. Ugh. So let's see. Back in the Talon territory, I wasn't meaning to go directly south, but we'll kind of go south a little bit and uh, 
kind of head over here. Well, let's see. So far, nothing. Well, tell you what, I'm just going to pause and uh, see if I run into anything, and then I will let you all know. Well, just wanted to update. I haven't really found anything yet. I don't. I guess I just. I'm in a a more empty part or something. I don't know. I did find another Talon territory, and there's one over here too that we discovered uh, early on. Um, but so far, I haven't found anything else. I'm just going to kind of fly over the water and see if there might be anything I might pick up but so far I haven't found anything so okay no luck there let's see where are we at now We're right here may let's see yeah there's uh Polaris over there I might just kind of uh fly south and kind of go down a little bit kind of below this section right here and uh, we'll see what happens after that well I actually discovered yet another Talon territory there's like a quite a few of them over here there's one two three and now four Talon territories over here so we'll discover all these real quick these little POIs stuff we got a talent settlement different places like that oh man you know what I for totally forgot I did find something and I forgot to uh, just not for we're ready for it or not but uh, I did find something in uh last episode when I was uh I totally forgot to mention it in this uh, episode. Let's see, where did I find that at? There's, there's home. Ancient shelter. There was something else that I found. Okay, that's the way we flew, but I, I know it was somewhere. It was, uh... It was something else, but I don't know where it's at now. But it was one of those uh, burial sites or something but I can't seem to find it now. I should have, uh... What's this? Ancient Tower? No. But I'll have to find it off camera and, uh... mark it. I forgot to mark it, and... now that I'm thinking about it, I didn't realize that I had forgotten to do that. So... we will continue going this way. We might just kind of just kind of go around this way and see what's over here, just to see what might be out here. So I did find a resource along the way. I found an iron deposit, so there is stuff out here. It's just that I haven't really found anything else so far. So just going to be traveling along here and I'll see what I can find well I haven't found anything yet but I was traveling along here and I was checking my map and I found a Xerax uh, a drone picked up on my map but I couldn't see where it was at I kinda wanna just go around and see if there if it's over here and see if there's something nearby just to, just because I I don't know what's out there but I, I wanted to kind of catch that on camera because I kind of keep our map. I think it was somewhere around in here although I'm not seeing it now but it was over here somewhere there's a red dot on my map it should pick up on my mini map if we get close enough to it uh, somewhere yes course it's not wanting to do it now but I remember seeing a red dot I'm just gonna go over here real quick and uh, just in case it was over here somewhere I don't know what it would be guarding but uh, 
I wonder if they just have like uh, Xerox drones just kind of patrolling the area, you know? Okay, here's the POI. Okay, here we go. Here's a POI. An ancient watchtower. Really nothing much to these. Yeah. Well, that was kind of a bust right there. Let's see here. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what happened. I guess I'll start kind of going in this direction and seeing uh, what's out here, kind of uh, in, a, in a northwest direction. But so far, nothing, uh, nothing to report. Just uh, doing some exploring. It's a lot better to do exploring in these. Uh, uh, small vessels like this because when you're in a biome like you know on a planet like this it has all these trees it's really rough trying to get through all of them on a uh, hover vessel unless you've got like a harvester or something and you got a lot of uh, room to store stuff that you harvest so yeah kind of just you know we're definitely covering some of the map let me go over here and uh We'll fly over this body of water and see if there's anything we might discover out here. Because usually you find like wrecked ships out in the water and stuff, but wait, there's something out there, isn't there? Or is that just trees? Oh, never mind. I think that's just trees. It looked like a ship for a minute. So, the only thing is the ship doesn't have a detector on it, but it, it, I haven't really got any signals or anything yet, so I don't know if there's something that might be out here or not. So, let me uh, do some more checking here. Well, I don't think this is a, a new town territory, but... Uh, I was kind of flying in this direction and I thought we'd go check out these POIs just to discover them and get a little bit of experience for it. I guess we got like another settlement here or something. Another one of these. These guard tower thingies. Outposts. I think you can do some trading here, you know, if you wanted to. And sometimes they have like, uh, like trading stations and stuff on some of them. Not like every single town and territory you find, of course, but you will find different ones here and there. So have I been, yeah, I've been out that way. Let's just uh, kind of head over this mountain and uh, see what's on the other side. You can see the moon right in front of us. Looks really big from over here. <laughs> It'll kind of fly up here and uh, just see what's over this mountain and uh, hopefully... We'll get lucky enough to find something over here. That's just how it goes when you're exploring. You have to... Sometimes you'll find something right away, and then sometimes it takes quite a while to uh, get going. But either way, uh, it'll all work out. So we'll go up a little bit more to the north and... Uh, just kind of keep our eyes peeled here. So far, nothing out of the ordinary. I haven't seen those borders on my map. I don't know if they took them away or what, but I haven't been seeing them on my map.
So we've kind of been over here, but I'm going to kind of uh, just kind of uh, run over this body of water just in case there might be something out here. Kind of far from home. Not real far, like only seven kilometers, but still pretty far away. Well, should I go to the north? I guess we'll head to the north. Why not? So I'm going to head to the north, um, see, and see what might be out there. Well, we have found another Talon Territory. There's like Talon Territories all over the place over here. We'll go ahead and discover all this over here. And there seems like there's something strange on the mountain up there. We'll go check out. Oh. Okay. Ancient outpost. Yeah, just another ruins. We got something over here, a ziggurat. Oh, this is interesting. Hmm, we might get out and check this out real quick. Real quick, if I can speak English. Yeah, there we go. Do I have my lights turned off, don't I? Yeah. I come in peace. Yeah, pretty cool. Whoa, that was some lag. I remember in the old days that these things would come and attack you, actually. But they don't do it anymore. So, uh, hmm. Pretty cool stuff, though. I mean... Yeah, I like this. I don't think I've ever seen one of these yet. Just kind of look around here real quick. Of course, if we uh, try to take anything from the containers, it will be considered an offense, and we will uh, <laughs> get on their bad side, which I don't want to get on their bad side, especially with all the talent guards that are in here. see here there's this area oh cool these lights look, look to be a little too <laughs> plain <laughs> I don't know if they're mesh errors or what but or if they are meant to make them that way intentionally but, yeah. Uh, well, this is pretty cool. Looks like they might have made this out of, a, like, a, a wrecked ship or something. There's, like, a number eight, <laughs> like, uh, scattered all over the place. Like, panel, looks like a panel of a ship or something. Alright, so... We will get out of here and get back in our ship. So another Talon territory. Wow. Oh, I thought... <laughs> thought for a moment that they were checking out my ship, but no, they're not. There's a lot going on here, a lot of lag. I don't know if it's my processor that's the issue or what, but... A lot of lag for sure. So, yeah, I guess, uh, you know what, I might head to the east a little bit. Go around in this direction. We got another what, settlement. Yeah, and I got another uh, Talon POI right here. And something up here, too. It's all over the mountains. Wow. Okay, so, let's see here, 
yeah let's go to the east so here we'll, we'll uh, yeah there's a body of water too we'll fly over it real quick um, not much uh, found in this episode but uh, I mean sometimes that's how it goes oh here we go no 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 wait that's the moon the moon was full of me thinking that it was uh, that's just uh, Elyon, the star of the uh, galaxy, the sun, if you will. Well, uh, yeah. Well, I'll, I'll uh, go ahead and pause and. Uh, see if I can find anything and I'll let y'all know when I if I do well I actually uh, was doing some looking on my map and I actually did uh, locate the uh, POI that I found uh, off camera on one episode so uh, I have that marked on my uh, map now which is somewhere over it's in that direction it's about nine kilometers away um, I'm just stopping making camp for right now because uh, I'm getting hungry. So I'm going to access my ship and get some. Uh, I think I got some meat in here. Let's see. Devices. Fridge. And we got a little bit of meat. I can eat this salami. And I did, did find some plant protein. I had to stop and uh, make a portable constructor because I think I left mine at the uh, at base or somewhere so I'm just gonna throw these in here real quick and let those cook and uh, might uh, see if there's any I th th thought I saw some uh, bugs nearby yeah here's some we'll go ahead and uh, no not the assault rifle go ahead and uh, get us a little more meat kind of brutal but you know <laughs> that's the shotgun for you oh hello oh he's charging <laughs> any more okay maybe not so yeah let's see here let's go uh, we can go put this meat on the fryer real quick too Access uh, that. Might as well cook these up real quick. We'll put these in our uh, toolbar and uh, do some munching. Oh, hey, you know what? We can get some good meat off this big dinosaur. It's a big fella, but he's, they're usually easy to kill, which kind of sucks because it's. Uh... Whoa! Uh, kind of got to be careful around him. Whoa. There we go. And I got some more meat. Let's see, where's our camp? There it is. We'll go ahead. We'll probably store this meat in the fridge. But um, anyway, that's probably going to be all for this episode. Um, next episode... I guess we'll go check out that burial chamber and see what might be inside. We might find some, uh, maybe some good loot in there. Just going to uh, put these in the fridge. Like that. So we got that. We'll go ahead and grab our portable constructor. I'm going to go ahead and eat these real quick so we won't be hungry anymore. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. We didn't find a whole lot, but we did get some traveling done. So, what I'm going to do off camera is just travel over here to the uh, burial chamber, and we'll go inside and see what goodies might be inside, besides any <laughs> bad things, too. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you all next time.